Hi everyone, it's Jeannie again, and I have a couple of things to show you. This video is going to be a little bit of a mishmash of um, things. Uh, the first thing I thought I would show you is um, some cards I've been making, and um, I'm calling these um, kind of like, they're kind of like altered shaped cards, um, because I actually bought the card shapes, well, let me show you the first one. Um, this one is just a regular standard card, but um, I've been really enjoying my... Um, my little stamps from My Favorite Things, and those are the Pure Innocence stamps, and I have a friend that is um, under the weather, so I'm sending her this card, and um, the paper that I used here was the Prima Madeline collection, which I just got in a rack from Kate at Craft and Kate, so I'll show you that rack in just a minute, um, but anyway, this is the little card that I made for her, and I just... Um, you know, made my own little banner there that's kind of dimensional and layered the paper and um, there's my little girl I colored up. So my little, she's um, a nurse friend of mine as well so I think she'll, you know, really enjoy this card. And then I did the white stitching although my, um, I almost ruined the card because my pen started kind of skipping and um, not working and stuff but I finally managed to get it done. So there was that one. And then these other cards I've been making, um, I bought some um, cards with envelopes, um, and these are in the kid, the project zone, the kids section at Michael's. And um, these, when I had a 20% off coupon, they're n normally like a dollar. And um, I happened to get this one and a one that's a star um, for like 80 cents. And um, I decided to um, alter them or paper piece them. I tried stamping them and. I don't know. They didn't. It didn't turn out very cute. So I decided to paper piece them, and I'll show you my result. And I'm really happy with it. Um, here's the first one. And what I did is I just kind of got into my scrap bin, and um, got you know some papers out of there. This is really old. Um, my mind's eye paper. I think it's Bohemian. Bohemia. So that's pretty old. But um, but basically, I um, I just what I did is I turned the card you know over and just traced the shapes um, on to the pattern oops sorry onto the pattern paper and then just cut them out and I used my oldie moldy um, scissors to make the top of the cupcake lining and I inked everything and um, just like I said put that put that together real quick and use the hello sentiment on there and um, just colored her up with my Copics and um, this is a stamp that uh, Carol sent me um, and so I, I wasn't able to paper piece her clothing because um, I don't, don't have the stamp so um, but I did go ahead and um, color her with my Copics and just tried to pick out ones that match the paper and um, I thought she turned out pretty cute and I've got a little bit of the my favorite glitter pens on her little hearts so um, that's how that one turned out and the inside the cards actually open down and the inside just says it's a cupcake kind of day and that's a sentiment from um, one of these up here innocent stamps as well and then I made one with a star and I actually made two of these but one I already sent off to Kate um, as a thank you card um, but this one um, is one of my little one, my little stamps that I have and um, I did go ahead and paper piece her little oh it's almost like a little leotard that she's wearing and um, I put a little gem on the flower and then that uh, glitter is one of my favorite colors. It's a Martha Stewart glitter, and it's and it's called Smoky Quartz. And I just love the color of it. It's a real pretty kind of medium goldy brown color. And then I have my Magic Mesh from years ago. And then this paper pack that I used was um, Lime Twist. I believe it's Fly Kite. So on some of these, and that was the same one I used for Kate's that I already sent. So I just put that on there. And again, once again, these are the shaped cards that um, I got for 80 cents, like eight of them for 80 cents. And then I just, um, you know, opened it up and traced the back onto a six by six sheet of paper and and cut it out and inked it and uh, made that up. So those were that those were really fun to do and really easy and really um, you can like I said I did cut up a new piece of paper for this one, but you could certainly. Um, you know, use up your scraps like I did on the cupcake one. So anyway, so that's the other one that I made. And then let me show you a couple of racks that I got. Um, Kate actually showed this in a video, um, but this is a card 
that she made and you guys this card is gorgeous I don't know if you can see the all the glossy accents on there but it's wood grain and um, it's dimensional and um, it's just awesome I love it I'm very thrilled uh, to have one of Kate's creations so it's just really really cute and she does a really cool method of she actually stamps the image flat and then puts the colored image over top of it and she paper pieced all of this you guys this, this probably took a really long time um but anyway i love it so thank you kate um and i'm excited i'm going to display it on my display board she has a little note in there for me but she sent me this along with um and i saw her do a video on this too she sent me this um cardinal punch i had just um offhandedly mentioned that um um, it's hard for, my daughter goes to a school where the mascot is cardinals and it's hard for me to find things with cardinals on it that are not Christmas and so she had this stamp or this punch and she sent it to me and it's a cardinal that's also the Indiana State bird so um, I'll find some uses for that but um, it's really cute so I really really appreciate that and then she also threw in the um, Prima Madeline collection, or and I didn't don't have this one. It's an it's um I think it's probably from last year. I don't know if it has a date on it. Um, but it's really pretty paper, and that's what I used on that little nurse card that I made. And this isn't new by any by any means, but it's real pretty. It's just teals and greens and uh, kind of pinks and stuff but I really love it so and I've used it already so thank you Kate and she had it all wrapped up really cute it was in craft paper with um, some baker's twine and it was just really really cute so thank you so much Kate I'm just I'm still astounded by the um, just how sweet people on YouTube are um, I've always I haven't have had nothing but really good um, uh, really good um, experiences on YouTube so far and I'm, I'm thrilled about that um, and speaking of um, nice people on YouTube um, I also got some more stamps from Carol some more stamped images um, she's so sweet she is um, I love tulips here on YouTube and I'll put that on the screen along with Kate's but she um, had had um, in a message, uh, private message, she had said that she just got some more images and would I like some? And I said, well, sure, I would love some. And I'm not kidding you guys, I got these like in three days later. So thank you so much, Carol. And um, so she's, she, there are all kinds of nice notes through it. Um, but she had, um, she actually also stamped me, I don't know if you can see there, but she stamped me some of her some of the little girls clothing on pattern paper so I can actually paper piece these so I'm really excited about that so she sent me that one and um, also and this is the one that I used already let's take these apart um, and I used uh, this is the little gal that I used no 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 not this one I'm sorry it was one of the other ones she sent me um, but then the little lemonade stand and um, so she sent me those and then she also sent me um, she made me some um, little chipboard images I had sent her the um, they're actually um, the um, how's the weather chipboard from Maya Road and I had sent these to her in her uh, Lucky 7 swap packet and she altered some for me and sent them back to you guys and you know my clouds and she like um, inked these or painted them and then glossy accented these and I mean they are to die for so cute and she did some suns for me too and just look at the shimmer on those I mean they feel like um, epoxy almost I mean they're, they're stiffer than that but that's what they look like they're really really cute so I love them Carol and she put them in this little bag and so cute so love it love it so and um, this is actually a little tag she made me last time I think I forgot to show so there's actually her it's ILV tulips on there and check her out she's got some really cute videos and she's a real sweet gal so um, this was a tag she made me actually last time that I forgot to show so um, anyway um, so that's what I have to show you I actually do have a little bit of a haul but I think I'm gonna cut this off here and do my haul later um, and because I like to stay under 10 minutes um, just because I like to watch videos that are about 10 minutes or less so anyway so that's my little share for today I hope you guys are having a great day take care bye bye